An interesting thing about this kit is that it comes with four different head options, as shown here on the box. So as we discovered in step two, there's four different head options. Now we move on to step three, and we discover that there are three different shoulder options. You build this ball here, and then you can add one of these three options to cover the shoulder. I'm starting to wonder if this is a good kit for me. I don't like having options and having to make a decision. Too many choices. To clean up the spots where I've cut it off the sprues, I've just been using my hobby knife and scraping along the edges here to uh, smooth them out. If I get a little bit of a scratch on it, at this point I'm not too worried about it because I'm more concerned now to get the build finished and put it together the way it is and then I plan to go back later and do some painting and uh, weathering on it to uh, add some metallics maybe and, uh, and do that. But just uh, my goal right now is to get the, the, the build finished by the end of the month. So the last two sprues have the weapons on them. They have a shield here and there's uh, some kind of a rifle type weapon and some cartridges and canisters. But look at this uh, sprue here. There's three different uh, colors on it. There's the dark gray, white, and there's even clear, some clear pieces on the top here. I thought that was interesting. So here's the uh, Gundam LEO NPD non-player driver's mobile suit completed with the gun and the shield and the laser, uh, laser saber and a second laser saber that uh, goes in the handle that's hidden in the back of the shield. These are the extra parts, the extra shoulder uh, covers, extra heads. So also on the sprues are some leftover parts. These parts here and here here which are not uh, used for this build according to the instructions they are not necessary for this build it shows you here on the instructions you see now the X indicates that the parts are not needed and uh, try and focus a little better here you can see where the X's are there that they're not needed. So those parts can go into uh, my parts bin and be used to decorate something else. So here he is, the final product. Body seems kind of short. It looks like he's all legs. But I'm going to call it done. And uh, another time I'll come, I like to come back and try to uh, do some weathering and some painting, add some metallics and that. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye for now.